Okay, I wanted to talk today about, you know, searching out farmers markets. They're popping up all over the place. And this is where you really need to go to buy in bulk. I ended up buying these tomatoes. It was five bucks for five of them, but they were huge. And they're so, they caught my eye because they're so red. The redder the tomato, the sweeter. The avocados, he had, he wanted everything five bucks a basket. And uh, the only thing I bought from this guy was the tomatoes. And uh, the peppers, those were three dollars a basket, those hot peppers. The yellow ones were five. They were also hot peppers. But um, <clears throat> you got to find these places. And you can bargain sometimes a little bit if you're into that. Most of the time I don't bargain. I just look for a good price. I mean, these people work hard getting all this produce there. And I, I don't like to nickel and dime people. But anyway, the pineapples look pretty good there, but I didn't get any. Sweet corn, sometimes I will eat that. I do not cook it, of course. Corn. Uh, raw tastes delicious. So I was searching around this market and uh, I have one contact where I get all my citrus. Not from this guy, but that stuff looked pretty good. The oranges that Florida has right now are Hamlin and the Valencias will be coming in soon. Okay, here's the citrus that I got in the back of my car right now from the guy I deal with, and that's a nice supply for a couple of weeks. So this guy here, he had the Coco Frio, which I, I did not partake of. I had it before, and uh, it, it wasn't that fresh. So the watermelons, he wanted six bucks, and I can usually get them cheaper than that, and I don't know how fresh they were either. They didn't look fresh to me. A lot of times with a watermelon, you can look at where the stem came from and see how old that looks. Totally stocked. And I've got another basket here. So I got six boxes, 60 bucks for all of these oranges. And that's what you got to do. You got to go to these places where people will give you a break on the produce. I also picked up some really nice tomatoes and I got some bananas. Okay, I got all, I got four bunches of bananas here, four dollars. And I got five big tomatoes, really nice and red. Remember, the redder the tomato. I'm going to show you those in a second. Okay, here's the okay, here's the uh, tomatoes I picked up. 5 bucks, but these things are huge. Oop. I didn't even realize I'll have to cut that out. But that's no big deal. Just cut that out. This to get a ripe tomato or one that's going to at least taste really good, nice and sweet. It's got to have full red color. The sun turns the tomato super red. The sun is what really sweetens the fruit. The sun has more to do with the fruit than the soil. The soil is important, but tomatoes will grow in sandy soil, but they need that sun to get sweet. So these are start, you know, they got a little softness to them. They're super red. So those are going to be some nice tomatoes. So it wasn't a huge, uh, I didn't get a lot of different things today, but I got, I'm well stocked now with citrus. So search out those produce dealers that will give you a good deal. All the best. Please give me a like, a thumbs up, and please subscribe to the channel. All the best. Take care.